Our COVID data analyst Casey Briggs joins us now in the studio. And Casey, you're not the only COVID data analyst out there. Yeah, hi, Gemma. Far from it. I mean, through this this pandemic, we've seen uh, a really a large number of people step up mm -hmm. uh, to help Australians work through uh, and explain the coronavirus pandemic by building their own websites, by building their own trackers, and by helping analyse the data in uh, in you know in in ways and publish all of that information that has been really hard to find. Sometimes yeah. most of these people they're, they're volunteers. They're stepping up, and one of those websites is a website called COVID base and until yesterday I had no idea who was behind this website but they have unmasked themselves and it turns out they're a gang of youths. They, they are indeed so uh, it was on the day that they got their Covid jab that they unmasked themselves. They are teenagers Jack, Darcy and Wesley from Covid Base AU and they join us now. Now guys uh, what you've been working on through the pandemic it's quite an achievement. Um, Wes how did you guys decide to start Covid Base? Last year I sort of just personally sort of tracked the data myself just for fun and I think at around February this year we uh, at the beginning of the year we sort of uh, where uh, Darcy's really skilled with coding and I'm sort of really into the news and all that sort of stuff and uh, being really interested in the data so we decided to sort of take what we've been doing and sort of create something with it and uh, yeah we've sort of just ever since we've just been we spent a lot of time on it to try and make it as uh, comprehensive as possible. Well, indeed, uh, Casey, what these guys are doing, it's not easy, is it? No, I mean, this is data, uh, this is a full-time job that I get paid for, I should say, uh, and these these guys uh, are not, they're, you know, volunteering their time. We're looking at data from eight state and territory governments, the federal government, the data formats change constantly. It is, it's a real, you know, you've heard me I've in the office. I've heard you at the desk. You know, quickly, yeah. sometimes yeah. saying some, um, you know, you know, really frustrated at, way, at the way this data can get reported sometimes, and these guys have been uh, reporting it um you know, for consistently for a very long time. Uh, talk us through, I mean, why, why is it that you wanted to get involved with uh, something like this? Well, the government's released data in all sorts of different places and in different formats. So I wanted to sort of, yeah, when Jack was collecting all this data, I helped him, you know, put it together and display it on a website so that it's accessible for everyone. So Jack's the data guy you've said, you're the coder, Darcy. Wesley, what's your role on the website? Uh, I, don't really, I don't really have a specific role. I do a lot of stuff like uh, getting events, making infographics, making emojis and like some art stuff too. And yeah, it always changes. Mm -hmm. So Jack, where does school fit in with all of this? Well, right now we're in Melbourne and we're in lockdown. So that's sort of given us a lot of time to uh, be able to do things uh, more freely. I suppose we do get all our school stuff done. Don't worry. But uh, yeah, it is a bit of it is a bit of a juggling act. So oh, I think you should be getting. I think you should be getting extra credit for for your schoolwork on this one. <laughs> um, you, you've obviously you've you've both all had your jabs yesterday. Your first spike vax Moderna um, vaccines. You've taken that opportunity to unveil your true identities, uh, like superheroes, COVID superheroes. Why? Uh, what, what's the reaction been like to to you know publishing your faces for the first time? Were you surprised? Uh, yeah. So we've been pretty much anonymous this whole time, and uh, we always sort of thought that uh, we did want to reveal who we were but we wanted to do it at the right time and get vaccinated really like the right time so that's what we did and we did expect it to do fairly well but we the amount of but what's happened is really mind-blowing we've got i think on checked over fourteen thousand likes which is absolutely uh madness for us and we we'd just like to say big thanks to everyone that's shown support because it really means a lot so, Wes and Darcy, if I can get your reaction to that, that reaction that we saw on social media, just how many people were so interested and uh, just really proud of you guys for the work that you've done. Oh, it was, it was, it was really cool. We didn't expect it to kind of blow up that fast. But yeah, the support has been amazing. Hey, just um, before we let you go, we've been watching and you've been watching the numbers of, of 12 to 15 year olds getting vaccinated very quickly in the last couple of weeks. Can you just tell us what it was like for you yourselves getting uh, the Moderna jab yesterday? Are you relieved? How long have you been looking forward to it? Uh, well, it was it was pretty easy. Um, haven't had any side effects, none of us. And uh, yeah, we just went down to a pharmacy, 
and I know a lot of my friends just around my age, they're all very keen. So it, I think it's it's really great to see the sort of um, real uh, excitement around it. And, well, yeah. Jack um, Darcy Wes, thank you for both speaking to us today, but also thank you for all the work you've put in through this um, pandemic. It is really a phenomenal um, effort that you've done off your own back. You've you've helped um, Australians, you know, all over the country understand this pandemic. Uh, you've helped people like me who use your websites like yours um, as an extra source and an extra cross-reference on what we're doing as well. You truly are. It is really a public service you're doing. So thank you so much for what, uh, all you're doing. Thank you. Thanks. Jim, I think uh, I've got to watch myself. I might be out of a job soon. Indeed, and they're doing it for free there, Casey. Yeah. <laughs>